we gear up for the total solar eclipse, we have to talk about something really important. Solar eclipse glasses. So I have a pair with me here, but let's make them a little bit bigger so we can talk about all the important things you need to look out for when selecting and getting your eclipse glasses before the eclipse. So 19 news, we're going to be handing them out all over before the eclipse. That's one of your first places and one of the best places you can grab a pair. But if you're ordering your glasses online, getting ready to get your family equipped to watch the eclipse, here are the things you need to look out for because there are safety concerns. So first things first, if you remember back in 2017, we had an eclipse. If you have some glasses that you left maybe uh, in your desk drawer from that, throw them away. They're not good anymore. They actually have an expiration date and usually the inside of your glasses will tell you when they expire. The inside of your glasses will also have another important blurb. I circled it uh, for you on the glasses here to show you. This blurb has some important numbers in it. It says ISO 12312. That is the international safety standard. Your glasses have to have that written inside of them to know that they are going to protect your eyes from the sun. So solar eclipse glasses, they are 100,000 times darker than sunglasses. sunglasses glasses are not going to help you and not keep your eyes safe. So you need to have that safety standard. Now that being said, if you're waiting last minute to pick up your glasses, you're ordering them online from maybe a retailer you don't know, anyone can slap that logo on. So make sure you're getting those glasses from a reputable source. Now the good news is since we are in the path of totality, there will be a moment for you to take off those glasses once we're in totality to enjoy the darkness in the middle of the afternoon. Stay with 19 news as we gear you up for lights out in the land.